Hey Sagittarius, welcome to your monthly love reading for February 2019. This is a general reading, so for further messages, please check your Venus, Moon and Rising Sun videos. Don't forget to cross-watch your love and trust reading as well. And if you would like a private reading with me, all the information you need will be in the description link. So let's get into your reading. So the main energy, you do have a very strong chemistry with someone. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. We have the Knight of Raphael. This says, committed romantic relationships, being swept off your feet, situations or topics that make your heart flutter. So you do have a chemistry with someone and I feel like someone is going to make some kind of offer to you or maybe missing you, um, you know, but for February, you do have someone coming in, okay? And there is a very strong mutual chemistry between you both, okay? So it's um, deeper than just an attraction. It's like a very, very strong attraction. So... Yeah, and the Knight of Raphael. So there's definitely someone coming in. And then we have the Page of Pentacles, which is someone who comes in with like a practical offer. So, you know, at the moment, again, you have a chemistry with someone and yeah, there will be offers that are made. So how you feel? Playfulness, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. So I feel like, you know, you do need to be a bit more playful, Sagittarius, okay? Because... You've got the playfulness card and there's a need for you to have balance here, okay? I feel like you do really want to move things forward. You're determined to move things forward with the chariot cards. But it's like, just find balance in the situation. And the way to approach the situation is just to be fun and playful, okay? So don't try to rush it. Don't try to be too determined in this situation, okay? Um, you need to get balance here, okay? So just approach it from a fun playful type of angle okay you know because i i feel like with a chariot you are very very determined so yeah just try to find balance just you know relax be fun be playful so what you want so we have deception we have the five of swords and we have the three of Gabriel. So you do want someone to um, come in, okay? You know, it's like for those of you who are completely single, you do want to meet someone. I feel like you're worried this person is going to lie to you because we've got deception and then we've got the five of swords. So it's like if there's been lies and that in the past, it's like you're determined to prove this person is lying again because the five of swords is all about um, battles, arguments, empty victories, trying to be... Um, trying to come out on top, if that makes sense. So I feel like, you know, there is a bit of a struggle here, but it's a want. So it's like, you know, um, kind of like a revenge thing. So if this person has lied to you in the past, maybe you kind of just want to, um, you know, yeah, kind of maybe get them back, not in a bad way. Um, now, this could also mean as well, if you've just met someone new, it could be that, you know, you kind of want to get to the bottom of who they are because this is all about wearing a full self mask. So you want this person to be their authentic self around you. You know, you want to get to know who the, who this person is for their authentic self, you know, who they truly are. So I feel like if you feel as though someone's not being real with you, if you feel like someone's not being genuine with you, then this is when this five of swords energy could kind of come out you know because Sagittarius is a very spiritual sign so it's like you're able to feel if when someone's not being themselves and then that could be when you kind of yeah maybe um not act up but that's maybe when this five of swords energy kind of maybe comes out so what they want so free yourself it's time to take back control of the situation we have the Eight of Ariel and the Queen of Wands. So they do want to get back in control of their lives. They might want to control the situation as well. And this could also be why you kind of want to come out on top because you can maybe see this person might be trying to control things. But they do want to work on things with the Eight of Ariel, okay? So I feel like they do want to work on it, but they're trying to control it maybe this time. And they have the Queen of Wands, so they're confident, you know, that they can work things out, okay? And the Queen of Wands... Um, this could represent you. So it's like with the eight of Aerial Energy, this is about, you know, putting in work. And it's saying take great pride in your excellent work. Practice makes perfect. Consider getting additional educational training. So it's like this person is still learning about you. Okay. So this person is still learning about you. They're still getting to know you. And they feel like they want to work on things with you. 
now. So that's how they feel now. What they want, they do want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation and honestly discuss their feelings with you. Okay, if, um, if you're separated from someone, they do want a reunion with you and they just want to, you know, be open and honest with you. So I feel like they want to sit down with you and find out, you know, where you're at and what you kind of want and they do want to reunite with you. Now, the barriers. So what you want hasn't happened yet, okay, because we've got to start as a barrier. So you've got this thing in your head that you really, really, really want, you know, it's like this desire and it's just not happened yet because the star is all about wish fulfillment. So as a barrier, it's like, right, I know what I want. It's not happened yet, um, but it's like you're not letting go of what it is that you want. Now we have the Knight of Gabriel and unrequited love. So this person is in your life and then out of your life. There's some imbalance here, okay, because the Knight of Gabriel, for some of you, this could be a fire sign, although it can be any sign. Um, but yeah, there's like a barrier is, yeah, so there's definitely some imbalance. So again, with the Knight of Gabriel, this person comes in our lives and then they're out of our lives again. So there's definitely inconsistency here. So because of this, you don't have hope, you know, because it's like, well, I'm not going to, um, you know, have much hope if you're only showing me inconsistency. So there is some imbalance here. Okay. Now, the crowning energy is forgiving and learning. We have the five of aerial and we have the six of cups. So someone has been left out in the cold, okay, or someone has been distant, but there is a forgiveness that's taking place and you've got the six of cups. So this person is really thinking about you. They're thinking about the good memories. You might be thinking about the good memories between you and a certain someone. But, you know, this is also um, the past card. So I feel like, you know, there will be a forgiveness of the past, and, you know, from where you've left someone out in the cold, I feel like someone from the past could return, okay? Now, the outcome is reconciliation, okay? So you've got two cards of reuniting or rekindling. So you're definitely going to reconcile with someone. And we've got a king of Ariel and the king of cups. So you've got earth sign and water sign energy. Now, it can be any sign. So I feel like this person, they're... They do have emotions for you. The King of Cups is very, very emotional. He wears his heart on his sleeve. So this person might express how they feel to you. Now, if you're dealing with the King of Ariel, this person is more grounded. They're more practical. They're not so much in their emotions, um, you know, or they deal with their emotions in a practical way. But I do see you reconciling with someone in February. So let's see what else is up and coming for you. Love and Romance Messages for Sagittarius for February 2019. Okay. Hmm. So, the world in reverse and the Eight of Cups. So, I feel like, you know, there is a recon there's a reconciliation, but some of you might choose to walk away. But it's like you still want closure. Things are still not... Um, things still haven't come full circle between you both. So it's like you walk away, but it's still not a ending because the world in reverse speaks about things not ending. So whatever is going on between you two, it's like it's not finished, it's not over, it's not complete yet. And maybe some of you really want closure in the situation. Love and romance messages for Sagittarius. What is the outcome in love for Sagittarius? Oh, so this one jumped out. Okay, some of you dealing with a Scorpio. I feel like some of you might even have options and maybe some of you do choose to end something with someone. So it's like this person tries to come back, but then maybe you choose to walk away. What is the outcome in love for Sagittarius for February 2019? The night I saw Jera. So someone is coming back, okay. Um, but I don't know if, if maybe when they return, you're just going to kind of finish it for good. With the death card, I do have to be honest about what I see. So let's clarify the death card. Clarification on death. Yeah, okay. So some of you are actually happy that this situation is over. And some of you um, have an ending which leads to happiness. You know, you've got wish fulfillment here. So it's really not that bad at all. Okay, so this is getting interesting now. What is going on in for love and romance 
for Sagittarius for February 2019. What is the outcome in love for Sagittarius for February 2019? The Magician. Okay, so what is the outcome in love for Sagittarius for February 2019? Okay, so... You are able to manifest happiness, but it's like you're in two minds about something. Maybe you choose to ignore someone. Maybe someone tries to return. You choose to ignore them and that, you know, leads to you being happy. So let's clarify the magician. Clarification on the magician. Clarification on the magician. Yeah, okay, so I feel like some of you are happy pursuing other ideas, other options, okay, so I feel like you might leave someone in the past, um, even though they try to come back, I don't know if you're going to, you know, um, give them a chance really, you know, you can learn from a situation, you can maybe choose to forgive someone but you know you can still do what's right for you and walk away so some of you might choose to end the situation if someone comes back and then move on to bigger and better things so i'm going to pull some oracle cards what love moments messages can you give me for sagittarius for february 2019 my month's messages can you give me for Sagittarius for February 2019 okay as your body becomes stronger you begin to feel stronger in all ways so even though this says get some exercise it's not necessarily about that it's just saying you're going to start to feel so much stronger you're really going to stand in your power in February okay and I feel when you choose to walk away from a situation, you're going to feel emotionally stronger, you're going to feel physically stronger, okay, so in February, you are going to feel stronger in all ways, okay, so, that's really good, so, what love moments messages can you give me for Sagittarius for February 2019? Easy does it. Stop trying so hard to control everything and all the doors will open to you. So remember what I was saying about achieving balance and just, you know, having fun, being more playful. Love and romance messages for Sagittarius for February 2019. Love and romance messages for Sagittarius for February 2019. Okay, and we have debt paid off. So the old weight and habit of debt is lifted from you and your life. So some of you are going to literally be able to pay off debts in February. Um, some of you are just going to feel like a huge weight lifted off your shoulders, okay? So it's kind of like, you know, whereas you might have felt burdened by a situation, um, you f yeah, you're going to feel like you're more free, okay so i definitely feel as though february is going to be a good month it's going to be a chance for you to get stronger um and i definitely see you standing in your power just don't um try to control the situation and don't let other people control you um and just take it easy you know be fun be playful okay so i hope you guys enjoyed this reading don't forget to like comment and subscribe and again if you would like a private reading all the information you need is in the description link